Tonight, the city of North Charleston is voting to approve bulletproof vests for firefighters. The city's fire chief is requesting 100 vests, which will cost about $60,000. News News' Travis Rice spoke with the chief, and he joins us now live from North Charleston with the very latest. So they want bulletproof vests for firefighters, Travis. The chief certainly does, Carolyn, and in just a few hours, we're going to find out if firefighters here will be getting another piece of equipment. Body armor helps reduce these risks. It protects an individual, but North Charleston Fire Chief Greg Bellano wants bulletproof vests on his firefighters in specific scenarios. We're finding from lessons learned at active shooter incidents is that at most of them, the opportunity exists to enter the scene earlier and provide evacuation and bleeding control. Chief Bellano says it makes things a whole lot safer working with other first responders. Our firefighters are responding uh, with most types of calls with law enforcement. And so we're on the scene and the potential for that risk exists. Yeah, like, yeah. Yeah. Over at Traffic's Public yeah, I mean, Safety people Supply, people pour over what protection they want. They know they've got to do something. They know that they've got to provide equal protection. Chad Watson says departments across the nation are following Suit. It's not just the police officers uh, that need the protection. Now we're seeing more and more agencies look out to, to purchase uh, you know, tactical protection, not just for police officers, but for their firefighters, for their EMTs, and even, depending on where they are, municipal workers. Back over at Fire Command, the chief just wants to keep everybody safe. To protect the responders that are, in turn, uh, protecting the citizens. North Charleston's fire chief added that don't expect to see any of the squadrons or battalions regularly decked out in these bulletproof vests. He says that they will only be wearing them for that very, very specific scenario. Live in North Charleston, Travis Rice, News 2.